fine just financially. But also, I feel like it's going to be a hard act to follow. Like, I don't want to sign some dude who's going to go fucking top 32 at best when the last person I signed won the biggest tournament of all time. <laughs> you know? That's... Woo! Look at Hungrybox. Seems surprised that he got a rest read that he's hit 8,000 times in his life. Don't be shocked, King. Act like you've been here. Pretend. Fake it till you make it. Good roll read off rip. Gets hit by 17 up airs and then into a crouch cancel grab uh, F air. Probably could have done a little more defensively. Um, but I guess if you just do a standing pound like I did against Zane, it doesn't fucking matter. I'll tell. Yeah, pretty obvious. Pretty obvious when Hungrybox goes for the full hop drill, it auto cancels, meaning that there's no lag when he lands. Hey man, can I get unbanned? Almost always ends I up I think tilt. I got banned for saying a cup equals uneducated when everyone was spamming her during TikTok time. Cole, brother, fill out the uh, unbanned form. I'm down. Uh, just ask a mod. I'll check it out. Yeah, you got a bit aggressive here, admittedly. If you say A cab, go live in a third world country. Oh, Ben, you cool. Bit passionate there. Bit, too, bit too passionate. You know what I mean? Bit too fervorous. Wow. Is he going to live, though? I think Hungrybox might... Yeah, he's going to live. Oh, my. What a king. Wait. Hold up. Hold up. Let's clear chat. She! 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 Saved it, saved it. And Wizzy takes game one with the knee. Hungrybox played out of his mind for a while. Did not end up closing it out. Ready, what was that? It's a chat refresh. Oh, no. Oh my god, Hungrybox, it feels like he cannot stop getting hit by up airs that link. And let me tell you, it is not a combo. That is, but not a third one, not a fourth one, not a fifth one. That's called bad DI. Grab, yeah. Okay, don't know what you were praying for there. Um, unfortunately, that is not a real thing. Okay, yeah. The empty hop's a bit too obvious. The slide off up air from Wizzy is some Wizzy shit. Didn't go for the up tilt that time, and then w Wizzy expected it, so actually a pretty good uh, mix-up by Hungrybox. Just grabs raw on the F smash. No fear. Fair, fair. Weak hit, strong hit. Fair. Should close it out. Cover that. You didn't cover that? Hungrybox covers it with a roll. Okay. Scary, though. You got to cover that down B. I mean, you're, you're good enough. You know how far it goes. You're good, man. Have some confidence. Up tilt? Yeah, pretty obvious. A little bit obvious there, Juan. I think you've done it about four times at this point. You had one good mix-up, but um, you can't just do one mix-up and then go back to it. But you can just do that. That works, too. You know what? Never mind. Fuck me. Grab? Yeah, I, I don't know why Wizzy is trying to get shield grabbed, but he's he's been doing a great job at it. Nether slide off up air. Pretty fire. Raw F smash. Okay. Really late on that grab, maybe 17 years late. And DI out. He's been doing that. He DI's out at ledge a bit too often. I don't know if he's hoping he's going to miss the dash or what, but I, I almost always predict a hungry box DI out when down thrown at ledge against Falcon. Ooh, I can't believe that missed. Bit of a shocker. I think it was a down B start up there from Wizzy. Okay, good read. Went for a reverse bear. Fair would have hit. I don't think he meant to turn around, though.
which case Bear would have hit. And reads the double jump. There you go. All right, you got to close this one out. You do not want to lose this one. You're going to make your life fucking hard if you don't win this game one. Okay. Weird shield grab. Get a hit. Nice. Nice. Oh, yeah. Eventually, he's going to break free. It's usually why you want to pound instead of fair, but I think uh, pound would have been maybe too slow of a startup. So, I don't think it's a mistake, but... Pounding at the when they're there on the ledge sends them to the right. Can be pretty good. 29% is not nearly enough for this to be guaranteed. So he can't die yet. You can't die until you get at least two more hits. Or you go for a YOLO Nair rest. That's what I would do. Hunger Box almost never goes for shit like that. Looks like he's going for some cheeky setup. Ooh, he had that. I think he thought he was a bit low. Reads the roll in. Good coverage. Nice! Reads the Wizzy uh, tech there and has the game. Wow. That was good. That was good. That was good. Hungerbox is a player who has this confidence bar that he does for his rests. And he's very, like, like some puffs, if the confidence at 30%, he'll go for the rest. You know, very loose. Some 50. Hungerbox, 90. He needs to be very confident that this rest is going to hit if he's going to go for it. And I think he hits 9 out of 10 rest attempts. Uh, it depends on matchup as well. But 1-1. One, one, gotta be happy with that. He is dripping sweat. My man out here. Looking like he did a 5k. Wizzy taking his time. Going through his routine. He does that after losses. Even after wins sometime. Uh, and we're going to enter a game 3. Very big game 3. Juan looked like he could have won game 1. And did win game 2. So this is this is looking interesting. I'm thinking of game five. I'm thinking we're going to have four or three game fives loser side here. Ready, All with the exception of Mango uh, Ginger. All right. This stage is hard. Hungry Box spent a couple years of his life going randomly like maybe Yoshi's story is good for Jigglypuff. And then getting absolutely smoked and then thinking, okay, maybe not. Maybe I'm capped. Maybe I'm capped. Um, so, you know, he doesn't hate the stage. It has some advantages. These platform follow-ups are pretty fire. You can get some nice early gimps, edge guards. That's what a gimp is. Um, F smash kills early. Rest kills really early. But you also die really early. He is the best, uh, and one of his best power-ups as a Jigglypuff player is that he lives. A lot longer than most players do. Um, okay... Yeah, good crouch cancel. Gets the fair. Reads that. Or maybe just covers it. Woo! Okay, you're going to die from a dare. That was a weird cutscene. <laughs> that was that was the slowest melee interaction I've ever seen in my life. That was some ultimate shit. Okay. But gets the stock. That's fine. Oh, pound. Oh, a little bit to the right. Could have grabbed followed up. But up tilt probably would have led to the rest. Ooh, good read. Nice. And that's something he showed against Gatsu. He has that tech. If you get dared, you can meteor cancel and then get a hit before the end lag of the move is done from Falcon. So Falcon hits you down. You jump up before he's done bringing his legs back from full extension. Uh, and he gets it there. Pretty fire move. You can even rest it if you're quick enough. But you got to be fast, fast. I don't know what that F smash was. I don't think it ever does anything. It can probably just be CC'd. Pound? Probably meant to up air. Either way, this is really good percent. Maybe th three more hits, and I think Hungry Box is really poised to win this game. A full stock, and I think I think it, it, he would be hard pressed to lose it. He's playing slow now. Why not? You're up. Play as slow as you want. Oh, could have fared. Does it anyway. Fair enough. Really good up air. Just patience. <laughs> and that's a timing game. Timing mix up. He just waits long enough. Okay. And it would be pretty surprising if you lost this game. I mean, you would need two pretty insane Wizzy stocks. Because at the end of the day, Hungrybox can guarantee trades with good enough spacing on fair and back air. Uh, trading with knees not great. You'll die before you kill, but you got two stocks, so that's okay if you die before you kill. There you go. There's one. He's going to throw out a pound, maybe. 
Okay, 100 bucks might lose this game now. 100 bucks might lose this game now. That was pretty fucking petrifying. Oh my god, clutch DI. He's alive. He's gonna get punished. Only 10%, 28%, not too bad. Eats a stomp for no reason. Gets a back air, back air, slide off. Wizzy's fucking nuts. These slide offs are saving him. Are they gonna win him the game? <gasps> you get too close. You're flying too close to the sun. Icarus, back off, King. Okay, you get your slide off. How about you get to the fucking stage instead of flying in the air? What are you doing out here? Are you a shy guy? What are you flying around for? What is this? You're flying around for nothing. Go to the ledge. Go out wide. Go to the ledge. He's not going to run off. He's not going to go attack you. You're trying to land high. Yoshi, sorry. The platforms are too close to stage for you to be doing that. It's not Dreamland, bro. You're being too insecure. My God. How many up airs? It's not easy. It's not easy to land as Puff. It really isn't. You only have six jumps uh, only. Lol. Forehead. But having said that, I mean, the ledge is fire. The ledge is good. All right, Dreamland is the counter pick. That's kind of a heartbreaker. It was Wizzy's counter pick though, so can't beat yourself up too much, right? Wizzy picked you there, right? You you were supposed to lose that by the book. When Wizzy counter picks you to his best stage, you should die. Um, all right, that's pretty good. That wasn't the best rest punish. I mean, one knee. You're not mad about that. Jab reset. Ooh, he wiggles out of the jab reset. That's some new shit. That's some zoomer shit. Wiggling out of jab resets. I mean, fucking hell. Are you seeing this? Every time Wizzy touches a platform, he just glides off of it. He, he's just like... It's like he jumped in one of those 80-gallon jars of lube. And he doesn't stick to anything. Touches a platform, slides off. Gets jab, jumps out. I mean, just nothing. Nothing is uh, is connecting and following up. The only follow-ups Hungerbox can get that are worth a damn are the fucking rests. And if he's not getting those, he's not getting anything but ship damage. Oh, and that's, that's bad. You want to follow up on that. But Hungrybox is the king of drill. That's the one thing that uh, you can never take away from him. He added that to Puff's repertoire. Is uh, Puff drill. And he, he gets it there. Okay. Nice. Ooh, good read. He tried to get down before Wizzy to up air or up tilt, but uh, but Wizzy's too fast. Okay, up smash doesn't knock down Falcon yet. Could have gone for another there. Goes for a pound, hoping that Wizzy would follow up late. Wizzy ended up getting stuck in the jab. If Wizzy was five percent better, Hungerbox might actually have gotten him there. Sometimes being bad ends up being good. All right, yeah, shield, shield, get grabbed. Can't shield forever. Fair. Should edge guard this. Could have traded that. Oh my god. Oh my god. All right. <laughs> Wizzy got a bit greedy. That was eager. That was some SCJ edge guard shit. A bit eager there. Uh, but really cool recovery for a moment. All right. Up tilt. Where's it coming? I'm, it's going to come soon. Oh. It's going to come soon. There it is. Another one. Oh, up air. Doesn't need it. Praises the Lord as if he didn't just throw a three to one stock game. I would keep God for the last stock you get here, King. Okay, get to land on that left platform that he loves so much. Down throw, goes left, re grab, down throw. Doesn't know his percents. That's that's a guaranteed, I think, to 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 knock down that platform. Ooh, could have shield grabbed. Didn't matter. DI out, and look at Wizzy. He gets the DIs in. He gets the DIs out. I mean, it seems like it's so free. Hungrybox is mixing up his DI. Wizzy's just kind of nuts with it. This should be it. Now just pound and live. Okay, there you go. It's a game five, baby. Game five. Funny to look at Hungrybox's facial expressions because every single time he even gets a hit, he it's like he's like, praise the Lord. <laughs> Prage, I've done it again. I finally hit him against all odds. As if he's not the uh, former best player in the world. Everything's a shock to this man. Heart on his sleeve. Wizzy, on the other hand, keeps all the emotions bottled till the result screen shows. Game five, likely Pokemon Stadium. Um, So we're going to see how that goes. It's not terrible for Jigglypuff by any means. 
Uh, and honestly, less platforms is better for 100 bucks. <laughs> it's good for landing, but I mean, Wizzy, you can't get much off these platforms against them. FD would be, I think, bad. I think 100 bucks has a better shot on FD. I, I wouldn't expect FD. I, I kind of enjoy FD against Falcon. I think Wizzy would prefer the platform. And we are in Pokemon. All right, let's see. Off rip, 100 box decides to just kind of stay in this left zone and just kind of space out. Goes for a raw pound miles away from his opponent. A uh, bit ambitious, to say the least. Shield grabs at nothing. Drill, up tilt, nope. Mixes it up, thank God. F smash, very committal. All these things are very committal from Hungry Box. Committal pound, committal F smash, committal pound, committal shield grab. Not just trying to space, really trying to get something big, early, and juicy. Oh, that was a, a, not a read up, surely just a misinput. I don't know who was there. Not immediately jumping, pretty smart. If you uh, actually immediately jumped, he would have died because the blast zone goes deeper in the corners. Think of it like this square. If I'm traveling to the left, I die earlier here as opposed to if I drift down here. So jumping up a lot of the time can kill you. You need to not jump until a bit later. Uh, and it's just good to be living longer. Even if he dies right now, great percent. You put 76 on him and you're living great. All right, now you just, you can't get, you can't get wizzied here. You need to trade. He's trying to trade, right? He's trying to run at him and he's trying to fair. But Wizzy's, no, 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 no. I'm not going to enter until I know you're not um, with Hitbox. I don't want to be with you when you are with Hitbox. Fair hits. Good read. That's kind of how Wizzy's been dealing with that. He's been really waiting there. Hungrybox decides to just float next to him uh, and gets the stock. Good shit. Good shit. Okay, Hungry Box wants something. Looks like he's going for a drill up tilt. Maybe a, a Nair grab. Something here. Okay, gets his Nair. Gets his little poke in there. Drill. No, it doesn't get an auto cancel even. It's just sitting in place and up tilting. Ooh, F smash connects. I'm surprised. Ooh, big damage, but no hard knees. Really good. That means he's going to live. You don't care about percent as long as you have your life. Okay. I'm seeing a pound coming from Hungry Box in the next five seconds here. Okay, there it is. Another one, though, surely. Maybe from platform. From right platform, he's going to pound. That seems a bit up his alley. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Unless Wizzy just never gets him a chance. It's got to be coming soon. Up air. He's above him. Oh, rest. No, a little bit too far to the left. I don't think he could have hit it. So I think that's fair. Pound coming. Pound coming. Where is it? Where is it? Show me. Show me. Show me the money. Surely. Surely. Nope. Was he too much pressure on his ass? Rest. No. You don't need it. Nice. Nice. Keep it up. One more. And that's it. Close it out. Grab the ledge. Roll up. All right. Two to two. Much slower than our previous games. Already three minutes in. This could be a six-minute game. That's a, that's a hell of a long one, to be honest. Most games are about four. Oh, that could have been nice. Up tilt. Oh, seconds late. Not even. Frames late. The dare just slightly beats out the up tilt. Uh, if he had done it maybe if three frames earlier, he could have gotten a kill. That's okay. Somehow I blinked and Hungerbox is at 70%. Jesus Christ, Falcon's a fucking truck. Good drift away on the dare. I feel like he's been staying too close after finishing it. Okay. Oh, yeah. Good read from Wizzy. Just adapting to Hungrybox's play style offstage. And you're high percent here. What do you do as Hungrybox? You go for up tilts. You go for up airs. You go for pounds. You go for something that will lead into a rest because you're not going to win from chip damage because these trays are going to kill you. Maybe a grab. Yeah. And the answer is probably not much. All right, you need a big stock here. Or maybe you can go even on this stock and take 70%, but then you need a big last stock. One of these two stocks from Hungry Box has to be a clutch box stock. All right. Up air, almost. They're so close to connecting, but just inches away. This 50%, and you've applied what? Five? Oh my god, 69%. Nice. Maybe an empty hop? No. Just a fucking annihilation from Wizzy. That is it. 3-2.
Hungry Box is eliminated from the event. Wizzy takes it down. I mean, game five isn't the game to look at. The game to look at is game three. The three to one stock lead from Wizzy. I think those will replay in Hungry Box's mind for uh, at least a few days. But he's resilient. He'll get over it. And surely he'll get into Summit. God damn. God damn, god damn, god damn. That means it will be Wizzy versus Mango, which I'm pretty excited for. It's the rematch of last week.